Hi, my name is Brad Workman. I'm a staff meteorologist here at Dewberry in Denver, Colorado. And today for Dewberry Explains, I want to talk to you about flash flood forecasting. Uh, the first thing you want to do when you're putting together a flash flood forecast is you want to take a look at the observations. Those are arguably the most important thing. That's the real world of what's happening. You can make a full day forecast with just observations. So that's, that's the most important thing we want to look at. Uh, secondly, we want to take a look at the model data. What do the models say is going to happen today? This can, this can help to further uh, your, your feelings for the day, or it can show you some things you didn't think were going to happen. Um, it's, it's good to take a look at. And finally, uh, internal tools. We have developed internal tools here at Dewberry to help us determine what the maximum rain rate out of a particular thunderstorm could be. Um, and this is arguably probably the most important thing we look at in a day as far as should we issue a flash flood threat or not.